My name is Damon Rubio with uh, D-Place Entertainment, and we are the current operators of the Fox Cinema here in Danny. We took over in 2019, about 20 days before we were shut down for two years uh, due to COVID. So it's obviously been a very uh, challenging time, but we are excited to be back and uh, finally making good on some of the promises we had and some of our plans for the uh, cinema. And uh, it's just been a wonderful experience bringing her back to life and uh, you know being able to serve the community with great movies and great entertainment products. The number of folks that walk through our door that just have a story. Oh, I saw this here when I was 10 years old or I brought my family here to see this. I mean, everyone connects a movie experience with this building and the fact that they saw that movie here. And so when they come to this theater and build memories, build experiences around films, but also remember the ones that they have, I think that's super important. And that's what really makes this place a focal point for, for that kind of experience. And again, it all takes place here in Banning. We do great programs with the Senior Center where we bring in seniors to watch movies, uh, even classic movies. We did a classic film series. Uh, you know, we work with the rec department to uh, do a kids series uh, all summer long where, you know, we basically show movies for 50 cents a movie and the school district too. Uh, one of our big uh, rollouts is we give, um, last year, I think 2,500 free passes to the school district so that they could essentially give them out as rewards. And those are all great programs that we love to support. And, you know, they help us obviously stay active in the community, but I think it also helps the community because, uh, you know, at the end of the day, people value being able to go see movies. And that is a great gift that we can give uh, to, to people. We've been super, super happy with the, the relationship that we've had with the city. The thing that the city's been able to help out with is the support, uh, the the kind of the marketing, or at least the, the helping to get our story out there. Um, and that's been great. Uh, they've also, you know, the utility department especially, you know, which is obviously part of the city, has been wonderful in working with us on making sure that we were bringing down the cost of our utilities and helping us with surveys to make sure that we're, you know, doing any programs that can be energy efficient. Um, and yes, even uh, with uh, providing small business grants when COVID had those COVID funds, being able to access some of that uh, has been a game changer. It literally, during COVID, helped us keep the lights on to be able to access that grant program. And uh, without it, I mean, we would have just been out of business. And thankfully, the city was able to help a lot of small businesses that way, and we were one of those benefactors. To the residents that have supported us, I mean, thank you so much. I mean, that's what we're here for. We want to continue to work hard to provide an experience for you and your family and for the community. The amount of uh, money that we've put into this place to you know, bring it back after COVID, to market it, uh, has been very substantial. But even more so, um, we are looking towards our next stage, which is uh, you know, a complete renovation of our auditoriums where we're bringing in our uh, recliners and we're bringing in our beer and wine service. And that uh, is gonna be a substantial investment, close to a quarter million dollars, which is a huge risk for us. But we are hopeful if we can find a way to level the playing field and give the same amenities, we believe that that love of the Fox, which has not gone away, will allow some of those guests to return to us because now they can still love the Fox, support a local small business, but also get that same experience that they're currently getting at the big megaplex down the street. Obviously the facade and the feel of the, the atmosphere and the experience will be the same, but the amenities will be uh, brought up to a more modern level, which I think is a win-win. And uh, we really hope to be able to impress more of our community and make them uh, enjoy coming here more often as a real experience for them and as a real viable option when they're thinking about where am I going to see a movie tonight? They'll go, hmm, let's go to the Fox. It's a great time.